What's up, guys? Nick White here. Tech and, I do tech and coding stuff on Twitch and YouTube. Check the description. Join the Patreon. Join the Discord. And uh, this problem is pretty... I don't like to, you know... I almost want to dislike this one, but I'm going to like... I just like everything, but... I don't know. This problem is not very good, honestly. Um, <laughs> write a function to delete a node... Except the tail in a singly linked list, given only access to that node. So the list doesn't even matter. Don't e just ignore the description, honestly. Basically, what you're given is a node, and you want to delete the node. So, and there's always a node after that node. So, oh my god, it's so dumb. Ba so, look, there's a list 4519. So you, you're given 5, you're given the node 5, and you want to delete node 5. So you have to basically turn node 5 into node 1, and then that's it. And then you delete it, and then that's it. So to do that, if you're deleting the node that you're given, you have to say, okay, you have to basically just set, make it the next node. So you say node.val equals node.next.val. And then node.next equals node.next.next. .next. And then that's it. That's the whole problem. That is, you know, pretty much it. I mean, I don't know what else to say. You take 5 in. You want to delete 5. So you just turn the 5 into a 1. And then you delete the 1. So you just turn the node into the next node. And then you just delete the next node by removing reference by setting this dot next to this dot next, which is, you know, nine by setting the five to a nine. Look at the solution for this. It's kind of funny. Um, and um, just for uh, reference here, you can look at this chart if you wanted to. And then but look, look at this. Look at this. <laughs> oh, God, that's so funny. Stupid. God. Everyone is so mad at this question. It's kind of funny, dude. Um, <laughs> yeah, I mean, that's it. I mean, you give it a node, you want to delete it. You set the next to the next next, and you delete the node after it, set the value. So let me know if you have questions about this. You probably shouldn't, and if you do, you need to re-evaluate what you're doing on leak code because it gets a little bit harder than this, guys. So thanks for watching. I will see you in the next one. And I appreciate all of you. Goodbye.